in this lecture, we will talk about what is the difference between a journey map and a process map. I'm sure as HR professionals, all of you are familiar with various process mapping tools which are used in HR to establish processes and policies. How is that different from a journey map? Why can't I use my HR process map to enhance the employee satisfaction because that's what I've been doing all the time. So we will find out answer to that question right now. We talked about the various elements of an employee journey map in the earlier lecture and I've taken the simplest form of that journey, the level one journey, and I want to use that to narrate to you three key differences between an employee journey map and a process map which traditionally HR uses.